This week we've been taking a look at the things that hold us down from within. And this is a very serious subject because this is the darkest time of the year and there are more deaths and more suicides between Thanksgiving and Christmas than at any other time of the year. The darkness just sets in. But as we've looked at this week, there is no such thing as darkness. It is just the absence of light. So our goal is to have that light enter. In fact, within this time, we've looked at Psalm 77. All we've seen is that darkness. But over and over, Asaph has said, allow the light in and cry out to God. See, in every tragedy, there is also triumph. Because in the end, there is a promise that comes in this psalm. If you read verses 10 through 12, the psalmist actually says, I have to consider the things that you've done, God. I have to consider the miracles that are around me. I have to consider all the things that you have had your hand in, the things that only can point to God. And it's when we turn there that we turn away from ourselves and our tragedy and we see God in everything. Would you take the time tonight to do that? Write those things down that you know that only God would have his hand in. And then rest in those. Rest in those and get some rest tonight. And as you meditate on those, as the psalmist says, you will know that it's God that is in control. And we'll see you tomorrow.